Welcome to AP Workshops and welcome to the oil filter edition of one of our tech videos. Welcome back to AP Workshops. We're talking about oil filters. This is the oil filter edition. So you may have found or may have seen on our timeline or one of the timelines a gentleman by the name of David Sherman. Hi David, how you doing? I hope you're well. I believe you're over in the States. Um, having just found his short oil filter being held into the oil filter housing with what looked like a clutch spring. I think I was tagged by about at least a dozen different people, but my mate Scotty over in Northern Ireland, how you doing mate? He sort of sent me a quick message saying it's about time you got on top of this again. So we're going to give you a definitive answer and some kind of information on what type of oil filter you need to fit to your V990. So first things first, we're going to give you the location of where your oil filter is so you can identify exactly what you've got. So if you're looking as you're sitting on your bike on the left hand side of the bike, we're talking here, so this basically just in front of your footrest, just below your clutch slave cylinder, here. Two different types of oil filter caps. If you have a quick look, there's two different types. This is the extended type because it blisters off the engine casing by about an inch and a half. Or we've got the standard type oil filter casing which has these markers on it, which if you look when the actual bolts are bolted down onto the casings, the bolts are flush. Extended, standard. So if you uh, are not sure, this is the extended type, this is the standard type, this is the extended type oil filter which won't fit in anything other than this. This is the standard type oil filter which will fit in both of them but obviously if you fit that into an extended oil filter without a clutch spring, hope you're doing well David still, then basically you're going to end up with this falling off and no filtration. Extended, standard. One more thing while you're replacing your oil filter, don't forget to have a look at the condition of the oil filter cover o-ring. So if you have a quick look, just to make sure if it's gone flat like this one has, then again, they're not expensive, just a couple of quid off of the uh, website and you can get those along with your oil filter. And I think there's even a bit of a deal in there if you go in there and have a quick look. Always worth changing these if you're not 100% sure. It's only a couple of quid, just check just to make sure. So if you need to go back and check this again, if you want to go and have a look on our website, you can go and have a look, www.apworkshops.co.uk. You'll be able to see, if you go to the oil filter section, there's a little uh, pictures there of exactly which one to identify. When you order, if you just leave a little note, if you want to uh, order a service kit, if you leave a little note in the messages section about exactly which one you want, we can make sure that's right. So we've got extended, which goes in that cap, and we've got Standard, which goes in that cap. And Dave, if you want to show this video to your shop, I'm sure we'll be able to help them out with the correct parts. Thanks very much. If you want to get in touch, you can get in touch with us at sales at apworkshops.co.uk. You can give us a call at the office. We'll do what we can. Emails, like I said, are answered. All the emails are answered first thing in the morning. We'll see what we can do for you. Thanks very much. Talk to you soon.